Good morning, Dave. We're here at the nine-year-old championship game. Good, Good to be sir. back with you again. Glad to be back with you. Nobody I'd rather do these games with than you. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the teams here. We have Esquire, Cleaners, and uh, LaSalle. Yeah, so we've, uh, we've actually got the uh, two underdogs uh, from the uh, game. We've got second-seeded Esquire Cleaners, uh, and we've got fourth-seeded uh, LaSalle Insurance. Uh, both teams played extremely well in their semifinals. Did they match up? They matched up during the year too, right? I believe so. Yeah, they uh, they played really well. They they actually played each other uh, very early in the season, uh, so it was before teams uh, became comfortable with one another. And Lasalle's on the board early, two to nothing. About a minute in here. Oh, and I know the the nine year old league. We have some special rules, right? No full court defense, man to man only. Yeah, we play eight-minute quarters. Uh, no, no man, uh, excuse me, no zone defense, man-to-man -man only. Uh, no full-court press. Um, we our foul situations are slightly different. We uh, bonus at the 10 and 13 mark. As you'll notice from a lot of you know from uh, how Jason refs the games, we also don't call every single uh, turnover, travel, foul. We'd be here for three hours if we did. So our league is really just a developmental league. That's why we held some of those special rules. Uh, it's just the D league, get the kids accustomed to playing on a bigger court, uh, organized ball with a ref, uh, and hopefully help teach them the basics of the game, the shooting, the defense, moving without the ball, that type of stuff. Here comes Coach's son here, Ryan Barnum, bringing the ball up. Ooh, just misses the pass. 23, Jonathan... I got the first foul of the game here. Liam DiLoretto, first foul. Gavin, come back. There you go. Two players to watch today. Uh, a standout for both teams are uh, 23, Jonathan Bichon. Uh, he's at the line currently for Esquire Cleaners. And we have Ryan Barnum, number two. Hits him both, ties the game up two to two. Shoots a better percentage than uh, my high school kids do. <laughs> so yeah, Zach, you're uh, you're head coach of the. It's now Dick Sporting Goods, the alumni league. We just lost in the final four yesterday. Tough loss. Yeah, tough loss by three points. Very good game. Wow, Bishon with the steal. Head up, head up, head up. Taking it to the hole. Good dish. Oh, big, big. Battle of the boards there between number 50 and number 33. The, these are big nine-year-olds. They're taller than me. We had, uh, we had a couple kids this year uh, that reached the 5'2 uh, mark, believe it or not, for uh, five-year-olds. <laughs> That's really tall. All right, and like we said, no full court press. you got to pick up at the half court here. Maybe got away. A little bump. Still 2-2. Two -two. About five and a half minutes left in the first quarter here. Oh, Let's nice step through. Oh, way to hold the pivot foot. Back to Mr. Hernandez. Oh, nice take. 4-2. Already a more high scoring game than last year's championship, which was a <laughs> defensive struggle. And there's the first foul on Esquire. You foul you on number two. You can foul out in our league. Uh, we would follow the same rules for fouls. That's Dubs Williams as he goes by. Dubs Williams. Oh. Now what I like about this nine-year-old league is that you play with the 10-foot hoop. Yeah, we use uh, the smaller ball, the 28 and a half uh, size ball. Mm -hmm. And, but we do use a standard 10-foot hoop. We use a standard court. Uh, no three-pointers in our league. Uh, just twos and foul shots. Oh, nice dribbling into the key. Another good take. Wow. 23, Mr. Hernandez. Uh, Bichon, excuse me, Bichon, Bichon Johnson. Is, he's got all six of Esquire's points. And it's 6-2. to two. Esquire again, Bichon. 
Bringing it down. He dribbles with great awareness. High pick and roll. No reason to shoot the three. Head up, head up. Oh, nice great pass luck. inside. It's going back down. Substitutes are at the uh, the coach's decision. Yeah, notice both only seven and eight players respectively on each team here. Kind of. Yeah, we uh, we had a little shortage in our our, uh, our numbers this year. <clears throat> Large part to. Uh, Due to another issue, but <clears throat> numbers were great because uh, lots of playing time for the kids. I can attest that I have 14 kids on my team, and it's way too many. <laughs> <laughs> that makes it tough, for me. even Six. for great head coaches like yourself. <laughs> Six to two here. Here's. We got our first time out by uh, Coach Rob Arnum. 3:50 left in the first. Six to two. And we're checking back in from the timeout. Sal Insurance with a ball out underneath. Sal, it'd be nice to get a bucket here. Started off the game really hot, been scoreless the last five minutes. And here's Barnum. Every year it's the, uh, we typically play our games at King Philip Middle School, so much smaller gym, a lot less lights. Well, Darker, is, gloomier gym. This is Championship Sunday, too, so all everything. Ooh, great pass. Beautiful awareness inside. The uh, the big gym, the lights, the cameras. A lot of these kids, first time on television, very excited. Oh, good steal by Barnum. Steal by Barnum. I'd like to take this opportunity now to thank our, uh, our wonderful folks at WHC-TV. They do a great job every year, and they put up with people like us, so that's really God's work. <laughs> Three minutes left now. Barnum. Oh, kickball. kickball. Side out here, 254 left. Jason Hall, a referee, with a flexible leg kick. And here's Bastoon again. No subs yet in the game. pass again. Jump ball. Stays here. Esquire looking to extend the lead here. Here comes the first sub of the game. Oop. <laughs> Checking in is uh, number one, Tyson Fulmer. Jack, you got or uh, right number four, Ben Carson. We had a lively bunch yesterday with the uh, crowd up top, up top. at the semifinals. Hope everyone brought their energy today after church. The daylight savings time always uh, always catches up with everyone <laughs> in this first game. <laughs> but I, I expect the nerves are going to settle after this first quarter and we'll have a little bit more action. 62, 2.30 left. Barnum resets again up top. Oh, he has the edge. Nice take. Oh, no contact. And that's going to be Esquire ball. 2-10 left, 6-2. to two. A little bit of a scoring drought here. Great vision by both point guards. We got our second sub there, coming in, Miles Gruber. Hey, Jonathan, if it's not there, I don't Both coaches, uh, Rob Barnum and... Uh, Paul Farrell did an excellent job with their teams this year. 
Yeah, two underdogs in the championship game. Love that. First game yesterday. Uh, LaSalle went into overtime. Uh, one of their players actually uh, got to the line with one second left to tie the game. Uh, sending the game pressure. to overtime. A lot of dribbling here. Oh, and there's a foul. Foul on Dubs Williams. And we got a substitute for Esquire Cleaner. Cal Farrell, oh, excuse me, Gavin Diamond stepping in for Dubs. Oh, oh another strip by Esquire. Oh, look at the lead in the break. Behind the oh, back. Pulls it up. Oh, all eight points, eight to two. A minute left here. Coach called glass for him. All right, we really, uh, it, you know, LaSalle really needs a bucket here. Oh. Mm -hmm. Little fun fact for you, Jonathan, uh, number 23 averages 23 points a game all season long. Almost a triple double too, from what, I'm at, from what I understand. Couple assists short. He is the Golden State Warriors. <laughs> rebound, White. Great rebound by LaSalle. Ooh, travel with 41 seconds left. Jonathan Bashoon has all eight points here. On an 8-0 run after LaSalle scored the first quick basket of the game. Up top, Jonathan, all the way up top. All the way up top. Great job, Cal. Rebound. Another great shot there. Coming off the down screen, Esquire has a very efficient offense right now. 29 seconds left here. Twenty seconds. Ooh, maybe a little travel, get away with it here, like you said. He was moving the right direction. A little NBA move for you. Jump ball stays, 12 seconds left. Got to look for a good shot. Tough loss for the Tar Heels yesterday. Probably the wrong play to call. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Does match the jersey <laughs> color, kind of. This play seemed to work for them all the season long. Coming in the new sub, Miles. Eight seconds left. Got to look at the clock. Oh, great pass. Oh, just short. One second, and this is going to end a quarter. Eight to two. Two to eight, end of the first. We'll be back. All right, and we're back, and we're joined by a special guest uh, from Park Tavern, nine-year-old Declan Ahern. What's up, Declan? Nothing. I'm just watching my friends here. Yeah, tell us a little bit about these teams. Well, if they make it this far, then they're probably, like, really good. Yeah, I heard you had a really good year, too. Tell us about your season. Um, we lost most of our games, but it was good. Great coaching, right? Yeah. All right. So tell, so tell us here. You, you friends with some of these kids? Yeah. All right. Anything you want to tell us, you just let us know, right? Okay. Oh, another nice shot, shot here. Friends with Jonathan? He's having a great game. What do you think? Yeah. He's got all 10 points. 10 to 2, Esquire. Oh, great take by... Barnum, another one of Declan's buddies, right? Yeah. Declan, did you have fun this year? Yeah, totally. Yeah? Totally. Are you looking forward to the Junior League next year? Yeah. Head up, head up, head up. Oh, my God. Another shot by Jonathan. He has all 12 points. 12 to 4 here. I don't know if they have a defensive answer for him. Pass back oh. to Warlon. Dribbles out of bounds. 6.45 left, 12 to 4. Couple stops, couple buckets. We'll turn this game around really quick. 
There just hasn't been a defensive answer for uh, Jonathan Bashun yet. Did you have to guard him, Declan? Yeah. Tell me about that. Was that tough? Yeah, it was pretty tough. He's pretty quick. He blew by me. And you're one of the better def – your first team all defense of the nine-year-old league too, so that's saying a lot. Yeah, totally. Jump ball, blue ball. Donnie, quicker, get rid of that ball. Don't let it get tied up. All right, another sub coming in, number two. Oh, Dubs checking back in. All right, there's Ryan. This is the, the premier matchup right now. Ooh, a little too much. Here we go, All right, Coach Barnum calls out the play, low tight. Oh, Bashoon getting a break Shout here. Checking out. Maybe a chance for LaSalle to capitalize. With a couple defensive stops. <laughs> All right, side inbound here. Barnum posts up. All right, the play they called was low tide. All right, here comes the oh the double down screens oh oh it was there for a second great defense by Esquire good execution by LaSalle too just a second late on the pass. Oh steal by Barnum coming back up the court he's got Weissman wide right oh good ball fake nope. another good take. Nice take. That was a nice pick. Was a good pick. Mm -hmm. Oh, another steal. Another steal by LaSalle. Nice rebound by LaSalle. Back to Barnum up top. Still 12 to Loretto at the top of the key. Weissman oh. dribbling to the left. Good defense out in the back key by Barnum. the big man, number 50. Great take oh, great take. Cuts the lead in half, 6 to 12. Four and a half minutes left. That was a nice shot. Barnum's got four of the six points. Nice pats inside to uh, Donnie. Behind you, behind you. Donnie looking to move the ball. Timeout, timeout, timeout. And there's a timeout. Coach Farrell with a timeout. We got two new subs coming in for the South. We'll be back. All right, back four minutes left. 12 to 6. Esquire, we still have our special guest, Declan Ahern, here with us. Dubs dribbles to the middle, passes it to number 32. Rebound by Barnum, pushing it up the court, looking up. Great oh, great pass ahead. Pass. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice shot. Here's that little run we were talking about. 4 nothing run. A couple subs coming in for LaSalle. Including the game's leading scorer, Jonathan Bashoon, who has 12. Nice take to the middle by Dubs. Barnum again with the rebound. Another great take. Just unlucky bounce. Oh, Barnum pushing it. I love this pace. Looks out. Number three. Oh, great take. Smartly lets go of the ball so there's no jump. It keeps the possession. That was a really heady play. Oh, and there's a foul. And we got a foul. Foul by the Yada Yao Hernandez. Subs coming in. Number 23, Jonathan Machine, number 11, Ronan Foley. Barnum smartly stepping back into the backcourt. No defense back there, so easy play inbounds. All right, 315 left in the half here, 8 to 12. Looking to cut it to a two-point game. Oh, just two stuff. All right, here's Bashun who has all 12. Little 4-0 run here for LaSalle. Let's see if Esquire can answer back. 
Great defense by Liam. Nice rebound. Great rebound and, and hustling up the court. Totally. Another nice pass. Second chance effort, just a little too strong. He's been hitting the weight room. Passes it to Gavin. Nice shot. Rebound by Di Loretto. Two and a half left here. Barnum with another jumper. That just barely missed. Just off. Just off. You got a little off again. And I'll tell you one thing, LaSalle is getting every defensive rebound. Esquire's only really getting one chance and they haven't had a good look yet. Oh, another take. The pace has really stepped up here with just under two minutes left. Now, Dave, is there is there full court pressure the last two minutes of the halves? That is correct. Okay. Exactly. So teams can pick up now full court. Last two minutes of the game. Oh, game, I'm the sorry. Last two minutes of the game only. That makes it very interesting. Yeah. Yeah. We had to do that. It was very, it was very like, I don't know oh, what, how okay. to describe oh. it, but it was like, my heart was pounding. During full court press? Yeah. Here's a timeout with a minute 34 and a half. Eight to 12. Esquire holding on. LaSalle on a 4-0 run. We'll be right back. Uh, the South checking back in, Esquire coming back in. Declan, what was your favorite part of the uh, season this year? Just maybe practice. We'll come back to you. Okay. Right. Oh, great pass. Great pass inside. Like Donnie scores the bucket. 14 to 8. That was a great play. And the first player on Esquire besides uh, Jonathan to score. Oh, good defense. Let's go stay as minute seven left. Passing the pace. Back to oh, the got him on his. Yeah, he got a foul. Smart take there. First on Jonathan. Number three, Liam DiLoretto. Felt the defender on his hip, attacked the basket, got fouled. Very good play. Ooh, going down. Minute left. And now Esquire trying to go on their own 4-0 run here. Are we munchkin free? So what was your favorite part of practice, or excuse me, of the season this year? Um, practicing with my dad. The coach and the games. Like the last one half of the game, it was really fun mm -hmm. because it, was, it put a lot of pressure on you. It's like you were winning or you were losing. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it put a lot of pressure on me. But I, but I do good under pressure, so it wasn't really like anything. Oh, Ooh, man. Nice An bucket. Another nice bucket by Michonne. He's got 14 points in the first half here. Well on the way to his season average, 16 to eight. Oh, great pass. Oh. Mm. I think the with a great shot. Don't shoot it. Coach yelling for last shot, but they go up and shoot anyway. And LaSalle secured the ball. They were thinking two for one, but there's no shot clock. <laughs> oh, that's off 11's hand. This stays here. Chance here for the last second bucket. Three and a half seconds to go. Three seconds left. Three seconds left in the first half here. 16 to eight. This would be a huge bucket if LaSalle can get a good one. Stays again, 2.9. 
Declan, it was a pleasure having you here at uh, on the mic with us. Anytime. He's coming for your job, Dave. <laughs> I am looking to retire in a couple years, so maybe you can take over the nine-year-old division. Maybe. Oh, and there it is. Halftime, 18 or 16 to eight, Esquire with the lead. We'll be back. We're back to second half here. Lasalle trailing 8-16. All right, looking for the play, a little late action there, and there it is. Oh, Ooh. nice hand by Dubs. Yeah, jump ball, white ball. To tell you how uh, tired I am on this daylight savings, I just realized Dubs is number two. <laughs> Makes a lot more sense to me now. <laughs> ball inside of Donnie, looking to... Great patience of the paint. A lot of, ooh, maybe a tip there. Nice rebound by Weissman. Back to Barnum. Coming back up the court. Looking to pass it inside. Just a little jump shot. Gets his own rebound. The importance of following your shot. Ooh, what an underneath. Now this championship Sunday is feeling real too. Uh, Mike Galtieri just walked in with all the trophies. I know all the hardware now. These kids right behind the bench, they can see it. Oh, answers, 18 to 10. 16 points for Jonathan. No participation trophies here, Zach. We are playing for first place trophies. Solid gold, too. Barnum being patient. Looking for the right action here. Doesn't see anything. Hits number 10 in the paint. First time in uh, 11 years doing this that we've got a sign in the stands. Yeah, well, the big LaSalle contingent here. Yeah, ball was definitely tipped. Six, 24 left here. It'd be nice if LaSalle can get a bucket and a stop. You move, Yadiel, get there. Weissman. That's it, Yadiel. Oh, yeah. Keep grabbing it, Yadiel. And there it is. There it is. Number four. Ben Carson. Ben Carson. Not the presidential candidate. Oh, nice great look underneath. At really good foul, actually, by number 32. He totally sealed off the defender. Probably saved a bucket there. Make him earn these from the stripe. Liam looking to check back in. On the line here is Gavin Diamond. Oh! Little unlucky there. All right, 6.05, left a little confusion there with the substitution. We'll say we got Cal going in for shooter. There it is, buckets. Nineteen twelve, six minutes left. Very patient on offense, LaSalle. Looking for the play to set up. Oh, There's a oh, bunch. Oh. oh. Shot. Looks like it was tipped. Rebound oh, by wow. Jonathan. Great save. Looking to push the pace again. Oh, good take. Felt number three. DiLoretto took it to the hole there. Say so we got pace checking back in. Oh, it's a tad long. Stays 1912. Uh, number five.
Good board by Barnum. Had to rip it out. He's dribbling with purpose, looking up. Oh, yeah, good take. 19-12, chance to cut it to five here. What I like about Barnum is he always dribbles with his head up. Yeah, he, he actually has you know really good court vision, sees everything really well. Very patient, too. Ooh, just a little. Makes the second one. Cuts it to six. 19-13. Oh, Jonathan, another great take. That's too easy. He's got... Well, Sal's really got to find an answer for uh, Jonathan. He's got 18 points. Oh. And there's timeout. 21-13. 4.58 left. LaSalle throwing the ball in. LaSalle's look good on offense. They just not really had a defensive answer to for number 23, Jonathan. Oh, it Blown in with the steal. Jonathan looking to push the ball back up the court. Oh, great pass. Passing the cow. Looks like stays white. It's going to stay. Yeah, that was off. I'd like to take this opportunity now to thank some of the uh, fine gentlemen of West Hartford here with the West Hartford Youth Basketball League. We have Mike Urban uh, behind me, uh, executive coordinator of the alumni division. Mike has a tough job, deals with all the uh, 15 to 18 year olds. And if anyone has a 15 to 18 year old, you know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> fight through it, fight through it. That's it. We've got Mike Altieri back there, second vice president. He's in charge of all the equipment, trophies. Oh, nice bucket. LaSalle Insurance with another bucket, cutting the lead to six. We have Joe Gamo. Two subs about to come in for uh, Esquire. Number 50, Donnie. And uh, number 32, Gavin Diamond. And we got Tyson Fulmer checking in for Ben Carson. What do you got? Hey, call up. I'll take you on one. Look at him. Coach calling out defensive assignments. Jonathan, other side of him. Jonathan, other side. Move, Cal, move. Forces it inside Ooh. to Barnum. Barnum had it sealed for a second. On your man, who's on 10? Who's on 10? Who's on 10? Well, Sal Cal, setting up again. Seal, seal. With the screens. Tries to seal again, good defense. Time Gets up. it in the pace. Ooh, pace steps, steps out of bounds. Out of bounds. Esquire again looking to extend the lead. It's really been in the 6-8 to eight range a lot of the game. LaSalle had an early 2-0 lead. Cut it to 4 at one point, and now it's kind of hung around this mark. Good offensive rebound. Cal with a rebound. Liam with a steal. Barnum looking to push it up. Looking at Weissman inside. Weissman's blocking him off. Passes into Weissman. Jonathan oh. steals it. Oh, he's got a fast break here. No. Ooh. Good defense. Very acrobatic, too. Great sportsmanship. That's the one thing you'll get in our nine-year-old division. That you won't get in many other leagues. Sport level of sportsmanship here. I can attest to that. 303 will be uh, back after this commercial timeout. Is this where we play by Alice comes on TV. <laughs> Keep 
can't be that hard. What? Oh, this is time. That one I know. The score, I mean, it can't be that hard. Dubs throwing the ball back in. Gets it to Jonathan. Jonathan drives to the middle. Just off. Nice rebound by number two, Ryan Barnum. All right, LaSalle's going to look to end this quarter. Who's on the man? Gavin, who's you got? Try to cut it to four would be nice. Oh, nice good pass inside of Weissman. Another good rebound by Donnie. Oh, and that's going to go down. I think that's off Donnie, yeah. A substitute coming in, number 33. Ben Alger checking in for Mr. Jake Weissman. Two thirty-four left here. Well, Sal has really stepped up the defense, and now the offense is struggling. Oh, great steal! Oh, great crossover! Oh, it was. Right, it looks for Barnum. Give me space, Gavin. Give me space. Help, Ronan. Help. Nice take in there. Oh, just short. That's just Jump ball going to Esquire. Been a little bit of a lull in scoring here on both sides. I told you, Dave, once the, once the trophies come into the building, it gets real. These kids are tensing up a little bit. Fourth quarter would be nice to watch. Jonathan up top. He's been held scoreless last couple minutes. Barnum with a great rebound, pushing the ball. Great speed with the ball. Dribbles, confidence, head up. Oh, great cross-court pass. Ah, oh, just off. Minute 36 here. Bunch of empty possessions. Oh, great take. And again, a little hard. Here's Barnum. Barnum pushing it to the middle. The pace has picked up, but the scoring hasn't. Carson looking to check back in. Dobbs with a dribble across. Looking to pass the ball back to Jonathan. Minute left in the third here. Oh, great take. Carson checking in for Barnum. Quick breather. Fifty seconds left. LaSalle needs a bucket. Great screen at the top of the key. Pace with it. With a shot. Oh. 36 seconds left. Right, coach making sure they know one shot this time. Didn't have as much success last quarter. <laughs> Looks like they're paying better attention here now. 20 seconds left. Jonathan looking for instructions of when to start up. Oh, great pass. Oh! Five seconds to go. Liam dribbling up the court. And a oh. foul. With point two left. So we got two shots. Again, there's no three-pointers. Ooh, just a little strong. Jack, Jack, stay, stay still, right there. No dancing. 
Here we have 15-23, end of the third quarter. Blue ball coming in. All right, here we go. This is it. Oh, great take by Barnum. Barnum with an early bucket. Cuts the lead back down to six. Like we said, this is where it's been hovering all game. LaSalle needs a stop here. Oh, lucky break. That's going to be a foul. Donnie with the uh, football slash WWE headlock move. <laughs> all right, let's see if they can cut it to four. That'd be the first time since the second quarter. Carson dribbles off his oh. feet. Dubs with the rebound. Gives it up to Jonathan. Oh, great take. Oh, but again, too strong. Back to Carson. Off the side of the backboard. Jonathan with the shot. Calls glass again. And again, Lee's back. extended to eight. Let it go, let it go. Out of bounds, white ball. LaSalle needs to be careful not to start forcing up shots. Still a lot of basketball left. 648 points. Donnie looking for it and calling for it in the post. He's got a little position now, they miss him. Oh, great take. Oh, a little, little hard again. Ooh. <laughs> Forget what sport he's playing. <laughs> Still waiting for him to power slam somebody. Who had three? No, no, man, he's got two. Jonathan, you're on five now. You're on five. All right, back in. LaSalle needs another bucket. Great oh, passing, oh. oh, look at this speed by Jonathan with the ball. Good follow. Oh, nice jumper. Jonathan. Sends the lead to 10. He's got 22 points. 24 points, sorry. Kid averages 22 a season. Oh, Barnum. Cal patient. checking back in. And Donnie, Donnie with a with nice steal. steal. A little hard. Saved by Barnum. Barnum looked to push. Looks up. Oh, good hit. Yeah, smartly he doesn't take the three. It's not worth it here. Oh, great put. Nice pass inside the Weissman. With yes, the sir. Jonathan looking to dribble to the right. Looking for a screen. Great oh, pass great inside. pass to Donnie. Oh, a little too hard. Another. Oh. Cal checking back in for number 50, Donnie. White ball here. Esquire looking to get it back to 10. Tyson Fulmer checking back in. Cal, who do you got? 
Sal looking to play with six. Strategies changed slightly. Checking in for number 33, Ben Elger. Watch the pick, watch the pick. Fight through it, two picks, fight him. Oh, a little reach in there. Doesn't. Jonathan, I'm your man. Get on the ground. Time out, time out. Good hustle, go. Time out, Esquire Cleaners. Just over four minutes to go, 424-1927. Esquire holding on to the lead. Sal needs to stop here. All right, here we go. Jonathan calls out the play. Oh, great. He's got great handle. Good defense, though. Sets a screen. Oh, great down screen. It's a little hard. Ball falls right to Jonathan. Good nice hustle, hustle by Roden. All right, four minutes left. Last half of the last quarter here at the championship game. Oh, great, great pass. pass. Rebound, grab it. Liam with the rebound. Gives it out right to Barnum. Back. Barnum looking to set something up. Really looking at Weissman inside. Nothing against stymied. Oh, just off the front of the rim. 3.30 left. Both coaches are very great, guys. Ooh. Oh, great fight. All right. Let's pass inside the Ronin. Back to Cal. Cal oh, Cal. Turn, takes it inside oh. off the rim. Just unlucky. I got to fall back. Almost, uh, last minute, or here, excuse me, three minutes left. In one minute, we can start the full court press. Who's on five? Who's on five? Pace with a shot, just off the side of the rim. Jonathan smartly lets the ball go out of bounds. New sub. All right, Republican let's go. Ben Carson back in. It's go time here now for LaSalle. They, they need to stop and Barnum they need to start scoring. Take anybody. Good job. Oh, deflection. All right, they got to clear out. 238 left. So back to pace. Pace looking to pick up the pace. Liam. Dubs with oh, the steal. Dubs. Great take. A little too hard. Rebound by Cal. Jonathan with the rebound again. Cal, bucket. Cal with a big bucket. Just over two minutes to go. Ten point lead for Esquire Cleaners. Liam bringing the ball up the court. Coach Barnum with a timeout. Exactly two minutes left so we can start the full court press now. Like, 
That's hilarious. Like, my brother is a little short fat guy, but he played on the practice team. Yeah? Yeah, I think Nick's a really good player. I'll put him up against any team in the league. Yeah. <laughs> and he's just like a 5'9 fat white man. <laughs> That's not nice to talk to everybody. Whatever happened to those twins when they got kicked out? Did that beef ever carry yeah. into the school? No. No? No, they, you know what? They got caught up in a the moment. They came back. They apologized to me and my brother. They apologized to It Stanley. was your team? Yeah. It was? They just got caught up in it for some reason. I've been I, heard, saying, I heard your guy instigated the shit out of it, though. You know, I, I've been saying this to Mark, and I'll tell you after. Yeah. And we're back. Two minutes left now. LaSalle needs a bucket. LaSalle calling out their offensive plays. Gives it up to Pace. Pace looking to dribble, Ooh. shoot. Jump we ball. got a jump ball. Stays with Blue. Barnum looking to check back in. Yeah, run, 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 run. Barnum's coming back in. Ronnie, Checking Ronnie, in for uh, Ben Carson. Ronnie, get two. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Maddie, get two. Get two. Little, little confusion yeah. again with the substitution. Yeah, you're in five. Move, Passes oh. it into pace. Jump ball again. We, we got white, white ball. ball. Great play by Jonathan. Not to foul. He has been Here we go. Here comes the, the full court pressure. Head up, head up, head up. Head up. Barnum with the turnover. Looking to push it. Foul on Matty Dubs. Looks it into Weissman. Weissman looking to give it back up to Barnum. Ball out of bounds by Dubs. Stays with LaSalle. Just under a minute and a half to go. Don't chase, Cal. Don't chase. LaSalle needs a quick bucket. Esquire is just looking to play strong defense. Chase, no oh, fouling oh. for Esquire. That, oh, good take. What a take. All right, here now comes the full court pressure. Full press. Control, control, John. Jonathan crosses half court, gives it back. A right, minute left, here they go. We're gonna little four corners oh, offense. Screen. Oh, great screen, takes the corner. Oh, good pass. Steal by Barnum. Rebound, rebound. Oh. That's it, that's it. Here we go. Spread, spread out, spread out. Ooh, double, yeah, dribble. double dribble. 49 here, seconds. It really changes everything. Sal looking for a quick bucket here. Look, gives it inside to Barnum. Barnum takes it inside. Gets the quick bucket. Looking at full court press. Jonathan dribbles past everyone. Quick shot. Oh. Just like Coach planned it. He's got 28 points. 26, sorry. The Coach table here. For any fouls. Out of bounds. Blue ball. 20 seconds to go. Hey, no fouls. No reach, White. No reach. Esquire no can reach. feel it. Up on your man. Barnum up looking up to push it quickly. Down. Gets it inside. That's you, Maddie. And there's nice jump ball. Great hustle by Maddie. 13 seconds. Esquire can feel it now. Definitely want to take this time to congratulate both teams. Ooh. No need for the foul there, Donnie. Gavin, your ball. Who's on 33? Gavin. You want 33, Gavin. Ten seconds left here. Don't reach. Don't, don't foul. Reach. Seven. Don't reach. Don't reach. And here it is, the champion, Esquire Cleaners. Congratulations to both teams. Zach, it was a pleasure. Uh, always a pleasure, Dave.